Hi, my name is Sydney. I am from Magnolia, Texas. I am a senior here at Bethany, and I just got back from Southeast Asia. But it was really interesting. There were moments throughout my time overseas where the Spirit would tell me to wait. And then I have to wrestle, like, it was for praying for people or, or sharing a story. And it was like, ah, you know, but I'm here to share the truth. Like, I'm here to be the hands and feet. So, but obedience to the Lord above all else and learning to wrestle that of, like, what's important? Seeing salvation, which absolutely is important, or abiding and being obedient to the Spirit as He leads. And so I learned a lot about what is fruit um, and what should be born within my own life. Is it trying to force this or abiding and allowing the Spirit to move? While I was there, I met this woman who sold fried rice and fried noodles in our neighborhood. So she was there really pretty consistently. Um, and she spoke a little English, which helped in the initial like learning the language. And I would go and ask her cultural questions and she just became my Southeast Asian mother while there. She had such an impact in my life that she continuously loved me and she would sit me down and go, hey, so that's not what we do in this culture. And so it was cool that it was both. Like I got to share truth, what I truly believe is truth. But it came from a place of knowing her first, of being close and of loving her well. And then the Spirit opened up all of these doors to then share truth. Um, and so I learned a lot about the importance of contexting as well and, and having context with people and knowing them well before sharing truth. It's really important there. But because of that context, I got to share the gospel with her. And she knows the truth, and I know that the Spirit is doing a work in her life right now as well. Yeah. I learned a lot while on my internship. There were a lot of really great things, and there were also a lot of hard things. Um, but just, yeah, life is hard in general, regardless of the country that you're in. Um, and so I learned a lot during my time there, and it was really sweet with the Lord. Um, within the first couple of weeks, we started a language class, and I realized I had this fear, almost like this fear of man that I didn't know I had. But the beauty of being through this program is we're there as students, as learners. And so to be able to be like, I'm so sorry, I'm learning, like I'm a student. And it just helped brush the situation over like, oh yeah, you didn't mean it. Like it's okay that you made cultural blunders. Um, but it was a really sweet thing of just yeah, growing in confidence and learning to love learning a language and just learning in general. Um, so I, I grew a lot in that. Global internship has really, really equipped me. Um, I, yeah, I'm all for the global internship program. I would really advise people who want to do overseas missions to go through the program. Um, I learned so, so much. It teaches you team dynamics as well, how to um, be with on-site team as well as the people who go from the school with you. And how do you deal with conflict? Um, how do you healthily struggle well? How do you hear each other out? Um, and then getting involved in ministry, and um, but then also learning like yeah, how to rest well and how to risk well, and going like I need to put myself out there in boldness in the Holy Spirit, and and to just really pour in and engage well. Um, and I also learned how to engage with the local body as well. Like the local body of Christ is there, so how do I encourage them? How do I come alongside them and just be with them? Um, so yeah, long story short, I really support the global internship program. I really truly do.